Well, this will be the most expensive home ever put up at auction. Now, four years ago, this was listed as the most expensive home for sale in the U.S. at $139 million. Next week, it's going to come up for auction for no reserve. The number of mega mansions like this headed to auction has more than doubled over the past year, and that's because there are so many of these giant homes with giant price tags just sitting on the market for years that the sellers just want to get some kind of deal done. Now, in Dallas, the most expensive home listed there for $50 million recently sold at auction for 36 and a home just outside Los Angeles, famous for the underground spa and tennis court and pools. That had been listed for $53 million for many years, just sold at auction for $23 million. Now, Peter Lynch, all our viewers will know him from the Magellan Fund, famous investor, he just put his golf course mansion on the market in Arizona. That had been sitting there for two years at $14 million. That will come up for auction next month. But this, this is the granddaddy of them all. Four years ago, it was listed for $139. It is in Hillsborough Beach, which is kind of just between Fort Lauderdale and Boca. It's 58,000 square feet. It's got 22 bathrooms, 11 bedrooms. It's got a private IMAX theater. The pool alone behind me is 156,000 gallons. The scale of this house is just incredible. We'll show you more later on today. But this house went up to $159 million, taken off the market. And next week, it will be on the auction market. So you can start bidding on Monday. You can go online at concierge and actually see what the bids are starting on Monday. Bidding will close Thursday. And again, there is no reserve. So it'll be really interesting to see what the price for this home is, especially as the Florida market strengthens going into the season. It could be either a lot higher than we expect or certainly a lot lower than the seller expects. Guys, back to you. Very good. Uh, wow. Uh, you look good there, uh, my friend. I, that, you're not out of place at all, uh, Robert, for some reason. I, I, if we turn the camera, it would look even better because I'm staring right at the ocean. There are pelicans, sailboats. It's just... The, the, it's 500 feet of oceanfront, plus you have a yacht dock in the intercoastal just across the way for two boats, two yachts you can keep at your house. So there really aren't many properties like this. And there's the view, Joe, just Good to Lord. give you a little water view in the morning. Yeah, begs the question, how many yachts can you water ski behind, uh, Gordon, doesn't it, uh, Robert? I know, and, <laughs> exactly. I, I, I know well, you've two. Heard, I know you've heard <laughs> that before. Uh, money never sleeps, pal.